what up what up what up this is style stars and Chris wisdom what's good gemini hope you guys are doing well if you're new to my channel welcome if you're returning what's good love you lots thank you so much for all the likes share subscribes all the positive feedback you guys are freaking awesome it's gonna be a love reading for um gemini sun moon rising and venus regarding a soulmate a twin flame someone from your soul tribe family member friend anyone or anything regarding love in the next seven days energies can be vice versa so get in where you fit in you know who you are in the story if you keep it in 100 um so this is going to be a general message if you would like to hit me up for a private you can hit me up at stars and at outlook.com i just got hella distracted guys i just like went right outside <laughs> anyways gemini uh let's go ahead and get into it All right, so uh, I feel like choice was in reverse. So um, some of you guys may not want to make a choice towards something or may not want to make a choice to do something. Um, it could involve a mother, um, a grandmother. It could involve a baby mother. I don't know. But when I get this card, the Gia card, um, it says connect to the pulse of Mother Earth. She will guide you through times of change. So I feel uh, whenever I get this card, I feel like it's some type of change or some type of um, something surrounding mother. OK, um, I feel like somebody didn't want to make a choice about something surrounding being a mother or um, someone may not have uh, you may not have wanted to make a choice. Uh, some of you guys, I'm feeling like you made a choice that you regret making. OK, but well, let's go ahead and get into it. The recent past for Gemini. All right, yeah, I felt like uh, somebody here was unfocused, okay? So you could have been unfocused in the past because it's air. Um, I feel like you weren't focused or you were causing someone else to not be able to be focused because maybe you uh, were coming at this person foul. Um, you could have been being a bitch towards this person. You could have been talking to this person out the side of your neck or something like that. Or this could be somebody that was doing this to you. Um, I feel like, yeah, so whatever... Uh, fucked up communication somebody was having excuse my French um, I feel like uh, you either couldn't focus because of this or you caused someone else another air sign to not be able to focus because of some type of um, combativeness I'm just hearing somebody was being a bitch yeah um, it could have been an earth sign that you were dealing with Capricorn Taurus Virgo <clears throat> I feel like, uh, yeah, in the recent past, this person decided to um, release some type of overthinking, some anxiety, because um, they could have been stuck in their head about this situation with you. Yeah, let me see. Yeah, but maybe you wanted to return, or they wanted to return. Let me see. The recent past, because I do see them looking at each other. Yeah, somebody made a decision in the recent past here. Um, I feel like somebody was at a crossroads. It could have been involving some type of money. Um, yeah, so I feel like somebody could have been being an asshole to you in the past, or you could have been being an asshole to this earth sign, but I feel like this person decided to, um, maybe you were looking at this person for finances and this person was working really hard. And I feel like, um, yeah, I feel like somebody was working full time or something like that, but I feel like they had to make a decision cause they were at a crossroads. Okay. Because, um, I feel like some, whoever made a decision, now this person is receiving uh, finances, okay? Or maybe you was receiving this person's finances. I don't know. But somebody no longer wants to fight here, okay? So if you were the person who um, was being a bitch to get somebody's finances, I feel like this other person, now they have money coming in. They're dropping some type of fight that you guys had. So you guys could have been fighting and combative a lot. Um, yeah, but so one person got money coming in and the other person got money coming out. Okay, so I feel like somebody uh, went towards their twin flame, went towards a soulmate, um, and they are deciding, to, and they decided in the recent past to take a um, a new leap of faith with a twin flame or with somebody that they have a deep spiritual connection with, because they no longer wanted to fight or be involved in some type of drama with you. Let's see. Let's clarify this though. I feel like somebody was definitely being immature with their communication. Yeah, somebody could have been, uh, you could have felt like this person was stubborn or this person was slow. That's why you could have been talking shit to them. Um, but I feel like you were also talking shit or you could have been talking shit because you were hiding something. Okay. Um, you could have, you could have been hiding something, uh, 
trying to be nurturing to this person in their face um, because you were trying to hide something about mother, something about a mother, or it could be that you were hiding something regarding you being a mother. Um, so you could have, this person could have been slow or you could have felt like this person was slow and communicated that to them. Um, you could have felt like uh, they were being stubborn and not doing something that you wanted or um, you could have just been, be you could have been being a bitch to this person. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, but I feel like it was because of an earth sign here. Yeah. Somebody could have been hiding something regarding an earth sign. Or like I said, somebody was hiding something regarding being a mother. Okay. Yeah. So a situation became too much and I feel like it had to end because somebody was putting in, a, I feel like full time, overtime towards a situation that was burdensome as fuck. Yeah. So I feel like this earth sign uh, could have gotten a new idea or wanted a new beginning in life, wanted a new start. Um, or you may have gotten a new start with this person. Um, some of you guys, you may have gotten a new start with this person in the past, but you may have uh, made a move too quick. Okay. And it could have bit you in the ass. Yeah. I feel like now somebody's anxious about the situation. Um, others of you guys, I'm getting that this earth sign, uh, could have been, like I said, somebody was putting in a lot of work. Somebody could have been, um, it could have been a stable situation, but I feel like you may have thought this person was too slow to gain finances or you felt like they were too stubborn to make a, some type of move or something like that. Or you could have been being stubborn trying to block this air sign or ooh, another air sign. I don't know. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Or you could have been stubborn trying to block this earth sign here. But I feel like this person had a good idea or and I feel like they wanted to go towards a new start in life. Um, maybe you felt like this person was moving too fast away from you. Yeah, I felt like somebody had to make a decision, though. They were at a crossroads because somebody was being immature, malicious, vindictive, childish. Um, as well as it was causing somebody some financial loss over here. So I feel like as soon as somebody walked away from the decision, d this decision, I don't know, incision, mm -hmm, I feel like somebody got cut. Okay, so yeah, I feel like uh, somebody made a decision to walk away from someone who was childish, malicious, and vindictive. It could have been a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or you could have that in your uh, chart. So um Somebody could have definitely experienced financial loss because of this situation, but I do feel like as soon as they made a decision, money started to come in. Oh my gosh, I'm hearing money coming in, boom, boom. Money coming in, money coming in, money coming in, boom, boom. I go so hard, I go so hard. Broom, broom, broom. That's a new car. Oh, shit. <laughs> um, if y'all don't know who that is, that's uh, a little baby. It's, it's Zaza. She um, she was like a, a internet sensation or something like that. But now she's singing or, or she's making music. But anyways, so I feel like so, as soon as somebody decided to make a decision to walk away from somebody who was being a bitch, somebody who was talking shit about how slow they were, how they weren't making no moves or to get money or Somebody was feeling like this person was, um, wasn't putting in work, but they were putting in work full time, overtime in the situation. Somebody was definitely being vindictive and childish. And I feel like somebody decided to walk away from that. And as soon as they did, money came in for this person. Yeah, it could be involving a new creative endeavor, um, a new venture. So somebody could have been sleeping on this person's ideas and shit, you know, making, making it seem like, oh, you too slow to, uh, to pop off. You too slow to become, uh, famous. You too slow to, for this business or some shit like that. But I feel like somebody was just trying to, um, like they were trying to get off their feet with this idea or with this venture or trying to start something here. But I feel like somebody felt like somebody was moving too slow to get money. But why is you worried about how fast somebody else is moving with their, uh, idea? Okay. Why are you worried about somebody else's idea? Whoever that's for. So it could be somebody that you was with in the past. Maybe you was expecting... Whoa, what was that? Mm -hmm. Maybe you was expecting this person to... Um, to support you financially or and I feel like it wasn't happening this person just uh became broke dealing with you or something like that but as soon as they walked away from you this person I feel like uh started to gradually work on whatever endeavor this is whatever idea this is whatever new beginning this is and I feel like this person decided to made the right decision shit whether that was you or this uh person this other person let's see yeah because it was too much conflict yeah but you, yeah, somebody wanted to hold on tight 
to this situation, even though it was too much conflict. But I feel like somebody walked away anyway. Okay, so you may want to, and it was a smart move. So, yeah, I feel like definitely somebody was causing too much conflict. There was a bunch of bullshit going on. Somebody could have been being an asshole, talking shit, talking shit about how broke this person was. They could have just been, you know, talking about how slow this person was to make moves or whatever. Um, but I feel like, yeah, somebody decided to walk away. And I feel like you either you feeling that right now or um, this person is feeling that. But, yeah, somebody may want to hold on tight to a situation that was just too much conflict. And um, I feel like it was a smart move for this person to walk away. Okay. Yeah, because they was getting lied to. Look what came out right after that. So somebody was getting lied to. Somebody was trying to have patience in the situation. But it, and I feel like the person who was lying, it was like a positive stress relief to cause this person burdens, to bring, uh, to keep this person in this drama and bullshit. But yeah, I feel like now someone is no longer confused about the situation. They know they were getting lied to. Um, it could be a father. Okay. It could be, um, so a situation with a father could be ending because somebody, Somebody was lying. Somebody was just keeping somebody in some type of uh, drama or conflict or whatever. Definitely getting an earth sign here, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. It could be a father, a baby father. Um, but somebody was getting lied to, okay? Um, and so I felt like this person decided to walk away from the liar and decided to make a, a, a new start or go for a new start, okay? Because something was just too much conflict in the situation. Let's see. Yep, somebody was causing illusions, and uh, it was, you know, I feel like somebody was causing illusions in this situation. Somebody could have been using spell work um, to try to stabilize their money. So I feel like somebody was in it to win it. Somebody wanted some money. Somebody wanted stability. But I feel like uh, somebody felt like, oh, this person moving too, or moving too slow to get their finances together for me. Hmm? What? Okay. So, um, yeah, I feel like it, now this person has walked away from the situation. Okay. Yeah, but you may want a reunion with this person. Or this person is walking away and now they have a reason to celebrate. Shit. Um, I feel like it's somebody in your family. Somebody you could have wanted a family with. Somebody, um, you may have reunited with this person's family. Okay, or maybe you walking away from me reuniting with this uh, family or this person's family or something like that because it was too much conflict. It was too much, uh, too many illusions. Uh, somebody was trying to keep somebody in a fantasy. Um, yeah, somebody, uh, it could have been a fire sign involved too, a Leo Aries Sag. Yeah, somebody was being a heartbreaker, and that's my Gemini card, so maybe you was being a heartbreaker, Gemini. Yeah, because you were holding on tight to some type of lack mentality or feeling like this person was lacking, like this person was, um, or it could have been your own mindset that you have like a poverty mindset where you feel like um, you have to hold on to every penny or you have to snake people for money or you have to try to win at any cost for money because maybe you're afraid to be poor or something like that, or it could be this person. Um, so maybe that's why you're trying to hold on to this earth sign, keep them in some type of illusion, keep them in some type of drama, keep them... I feel like frazzled, like they were just, <sighs> this person was anxious, this person was scared all the time, this person was, um, I feel like they were just all over the place because somebody was trying to cause this bullshit in this person's head so that they can continue to use them for money. But I feel like this person wa is walking away and <clears throat> you may want a reunion with this person or something like that, but um, you want a reunion, but you still just want them for the finances. So it was a smart move for this person to um, walk away because you were indecisive. You couldn't make a decision. You couldn't decide whether you wanted to be nice to this person or an asshole, you know. And also, you couldn't make a decision to tell the truth. Somebody was lying here, okay? Somebody was getting lied to, although they were trying to have patience in the situation. Or you may be trying to have patience in the situation because you know you lied to this person and you want to hold on to this person. You know they're walking away, but you like, mm, maybe, just maybe. Are you mentally confused, Gemini? Okay, or is this person confused? Uh, yeah, maybe you were confused because this is a good investment. Or maybe you're trying to, oh, I was confused before. I didn't know, you know. I feel like somebody trying to play dumb. I, I didn't understand what, what I was doing. I didn't understand I was causing this person heartache. I didn't understand this. I was causing this person um a bunch of anxiety and depression. I didn't know, you know. I feel like, you know, but... Yeah. Now this person's not communicating, okay? Yeah, I feel like this person could have moved forward. This person could have uh, 
proposed to someone else, got married or something like that. But I feel like now somebody's trying to play play dumb or play confused, even though they know they was lying to this person. They know they were causing conflict. They know it was like a positive stress relief for this person to be a bitch to somebody. Okay? That's crazy. In the next seven days for Gemini. Yeah, I feel like somebody should, yeah, whoever this is, you know, you made the wrong choice here, buddy. That's what I feel like. Somebody made the wrong choice. All right, yeah, I feel like, yeah, now somebody um, is holding back harsh words or harsh actions. Somebody wants to come at somebody crazy because they have low self-esteem now. They feel insecure because they lied in the past. They knew they were lying. They knew it was okay when they was uh, when they was on the top of this, uh, this Ferris wheel. But now somebody fell off the Ferris wheel. And now I feel like the person who was scamming or scheming or causing conflict in somebody's life, now this person is feeling low self-esteem and insecure. Because now they 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 lost their income, they lost their uh, gravy train. So I feel like this person may you may want to communicate if this is you, or you want, may want to rush in and and yell at this person or talk shit to this person. But that's nothing new. It, weren't you doing this before? Yeah, I feel like now somebody's stagnant, stuck, feeling stupid because they know they lied in the past. They know they could have been lying about a Cancer Pisces Scorpio. Um, they could have been lying about another air sign. But yeah, I feel like it's time for, if this was you, you know, it's time for you to love yourself, okay? I feel like somebody needs to focus on loving themselves, giving themselves self-care and love instead of trying to uh, hold on to people and shit in situations for money. Yeah, it's time for you to love yourself, okay? Or somebody is loving themselves and getting the hell up out of this situation in the next seven days. But let's see, next seven days for Gemini. So yeah, you, if this is you, you know, you know who you are in the story, but... This is you. I feel like you should not make the decision to come at this person stupid because, um, yeah, I feel like uh, you juggling too much here. OK, you had this person juggling too much in the past, so they could be even holding back harsh words towards you or harsh actions towards you because they know that you had them juggling. They know that you could have been juggling other people. OK, um, but yeah, I feel like now somebody is, uh, got their ten of cups. Somebody is happy. Somebody is in a happy family situation, feeling complete, feeling whole within this, within themselves, while somebody else is feeling insecure and has low self esteem now. Because now you see, or it's now somebody is seeing that this person is truly happy. Yeah, and financially stable. Dang, that sucks. That really sucks that somebody slept on somebody um, that they were using in the first place and now they feel insecure because now they see this person did take that, take those steps. They may have been slow, but the person was taking these steps because nothing had, Rome wasn't built in a day, boo boo. So I feel like somebody here is now having to watch somebody go towards happiness and love somewhere else and there's financial stability um, in this new place or with this new person or in this new situation. Um... But I feel like that's making somebody feel insecure here. Yeah, because somebody is completely happy, okay? You could be watching this person completely happy. Yeah, and now you stuck. Now you stuck like Chuck because somebody was talking shit. Somebody was, uh, yeah, I feel like you definitely are watching this person. Um, you could you could have been acting wild and crazy and childish and trying to stagnate this person. And now you see that. Somebody now sees that they were trying to, uh, that they were stagnating somebody from going towards the money or the bag that they wanted. That's dumb. Okay. That's dumb. If you want somebody to get money for you, why you go stagnate this person and cause them all this depression and ill will and shit like spell. Somebody could have been doing spell work and shit. Yeah, but I feel like now somebody is loving themselves and they live in their life like it's golden. This person is going to be financially stable here. Um, maybe you want to reunite with this person because of that, okay? I feel like you see, yeah, but this person knows somebody was a cheater, okay? If it wasn't a cheating situation, like a love situation where somebody was cheating in the past, I feel like somebody knows that you just was in and out anyway, that you, you know, you were indecisive about them, you were secretly talking shit behind their back, all right, I'm also hearing somebody could have slept with somebody's friend behind their back. Yeah, for money? Mm, okay. Moving forward. <laughs> Gemini. Oh, yeah, happy birthday, Gemini. <laughs> happy birthday to you all. 
oh yeah, somebody was definitely being overindulgent and materialistic in this situation. And now it's time for you to make the right choice and tell the truth. Or make the right choice and keep it pushing because you didn't make the right choice in the past. Or somebody didn't. Yeah, now you're worried or afraid or depressed in your head. Yeah, because now you, you can't work together with this person that you now see as successful after you slept on this person. Or somebody slept on you, okay? But anyways, let's see what signs you could be dealing with, Gemini. Libra. Pisces, Virgo. So you could be dealing with a Libra, Pisces, and a Virgo in the next seven days. Let me see. Let me use these. All right. So <clears throat> advice for you and a Libra in the next seven days. Got the hiccups. <laughs> Advice between you and a Libra in the next seven days. Oh, yeah. So you could be feeling left out in the cold by a Libra. So this could be you. You could have did this Libra dirty. Um, you could have left this person out in the cold for a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Or um, this person has water in their chart. But I feel like somebody got left out in the cold. Um, maybe it's good for you to focus on your health, okay? Um, some of you guys may need to focus on your health, maybe mental health or something like that. Something that has been uh, plaguing you since you were a child. Okay, but or a child is getting left out in the cold because somebody found out that somebody was noncommittal in the past. Somebody could find out that somebody ain't they, it ain't somebody kid, you know what I'm saying? So it could be that you uh, told a Libra that it was your baby or something like that or their baby or something like that. But um, I feel like somebody's mental health could have caused them to just be all over the place, scatter their energy, scatter their, uh, spread their legs to a lot of people or something like that. But yeah, now this person is feeling left on the cold. So I don't know if it's you or this Libra, but um, yeah, somebody was noncommittal in this situation and now somebody may not have a home or may, now somebody ain't coming back home or something like that. Yeah, because somebody knows you cheated or somebody knows that you wasn't committed to them in a situation for real, for real. And uh, now you may be feeling left out in the cold by this person. It could be vice versa, though, Gemini. I don't know. All right. So, yeah, something is not going to prosper because somebody was using spell work, black magic. Uh, somebody was in, their, in, in some devil energy, making deals with the devil. Yeah. But I feel like somebody here was meant to go towards music or somebody spiritually gifted or something like that. It could be a musician you're dealing with. Um, but yeah, I feel like you didn't want this person to leave. So that's why they couldn't prosper, but you still wanted money from them or something like that. Um, it was an illusion though. Okay. So it's time for you to release fear in this situation and possibly just focus on loving yourself because you didn't learn a lesson when it, when it was presented to you. Okay. Yeah. That this person would be successful, but you, um, you could have been sleeping on this person to be honest. Yeah. It was positive for this person to travel. Okay. To have success in a passion. All right, so between you and a Pisces, yeah, okay, so if you are dealing with a Pisces, I feel like there is mutual love between you and this person, um, or some this Pisces went towards someone else and got mutual love and wealth, okay, and I feel like it is a positive, um, it's a soulmate, it's a, a true love situation, yeah, someone, this Pisces is welcoming this situation, is welcoming this wealth, is welcoming this mutual love, is welcoming this true love situation, so if you're dealing with a Pisces, you know, I feel like there's mutual love between you and this person um, or this Piscean found love elsewhere and money. OK, I'm hearing that it could be the person that uh, so uh, hell a Libra could have went towards a Pisces because you may have did them dirty. And so now they went towards a true love person who they can actually manifest wealth with because it's destined. All right. It was never destined for them to be with a snake. All right, yeah, because somebody, uh, spirit in reverse, this is low vibe. So this was a low vibe situation. Um, while somebody created a life, anyways. So, um, yeah, I feel like you may want to retreat from this situation because I feel like this person did go towards love, okay? Let's see, between you and a Virgo. Yep, 
whatever confusion uh, this person was trying to cause you or whatever you were trying to cause or whatever confusion you were trying to cause this person, it's not going to last forever. So um, I feel like whatever spell work somebody was doing, that shit is dead now. Yeah, it couldn't stop this higher level of commitment from happening. Yeah, somebody didn't want to let go. Maybe somebody wanted to get married to somebody or something like that. But the answer is no. Okay, so no to a higher level of commitment with this person. Um, I feel like you were trying to think positive, but it's, somebody's health was bad. Okay, could be someone's mental health was bad. Um, yeah, somebody was conflicted mentally here, and that's why there was no growth in the situation. Yep, but this person is blessed with financial abundance, but somebody needed to release a fire sign. Yeah, I feel like, yeah, somebody, you could have been waiting for this person to return, but they have no desire to return to this situation, okay? Yep, because they could have a faded love that is positive, um, and they feel like you're unstable, or this situation was, this situation was unstable with you. Um, yeah, but it's time for somebody to speak up for themselves, because the Most High is saying that justice is being served in this situation, and somebody can no longer affect this Virgo no more, um, so somebody can no longer affect this Libra no more. Yeah, because it was low energy. It was demonic energies trying to stop a dream come true from happening, but case is closed in this situation, okay? So I don't know who you are in this situ in this story, Gemini, but look, it's time to release illusions of the situation. You did not make the right choice, possibly. Yeah, to emotionally manipulate somebody regarding sex, you know what I'm saying? So you could have lied, like I said, somebody lied surrounding sex uh, with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or somebody lied um, about a child, yeah, somebody was lying. They was having sex with other people. Yeah, this person was also abusive. That's why they were abusive, because um, of some type of lies, deceit. Um, yeah, but now someone's losing a home, okay, because of that. Yeah, it's time to reflect on the truth about this situation. Or someone's not coming back home because of that. Yeah, it's too much work now. This person's an earth angel. They already know what's good. So if this person was dealing with you and you're a low vibe, you know, uh, they know what's up now. And if this is you, if you were dealing with low vibe energies, I feel like you are moving on from this because somebody didn't make the right choice. Okay. They didn't choose you. All right. Or you didn't make the right choice. Much love. Later.